Adhoniwa amjabu nyote Mgeni wetu wa heshma Bwana Masharia Tumefika hapa Kukusudikisa Mimi naitu wa Kiroga Dhuku Na kwetu ni Udhaya Mimi ni MC ye wa pahali naitu wa Shinga Kule kwa mzee kibaki Simuna mjua? Simuna jua hiyo maneno? Wani hiko haja ikine? Hakuna haja na kwa mapenzi ya Mungu rais wetu naye wakati tulimaliza ushaguzi akaweza kusema mimi nisimamie MCA wote wa chama yetu kama MCA ama kama national chairperson wa MCA caucus wa UDA sasa MCA yote Kenya yote amechaguliwa na UDA mimi naenda kukaa kwa neck kwa niaba yao <coughs> kwa hivyo Tumeleta huyu bwana hapa na mheshimiwa Sudi mimi sana. You are such a brother. You are a good man. Unajua you are our friend and some of the things you do they really touch us to our hearts. Na ndio tunasema mtu asishagulie mwingine rafiki. Wewe ukikubana na mtu uwabieni uweke wapi? Kwen wewe marafiki ya mtu achana nao maana yake hata hii mambo yote mmeona inazunguka hivi ni juu watu wengine wanataka akikuona unaongea na yule anakwambia hapana huyo ni adui yako siongee na yeye sasa mimi mheshimiwa sudi nitamchukia amenifanyia nini sasa unaona ameshikia huyu kijana imagine all these all these people here umeona amekuja na ofisi yake mzima kushikilia huyu kijana hata sio wa kabila yake hata hatoki kijiji yao. Na hizi ni mchango mzuri. That is the Kenya we want. Na huyu kijana ni kijana mzuri sana anaitwa Masharia. Unaona anakaa vizuri hapa na wadosi na wewe bwana hata utakuwa mdosi bwana. Eh, eh, mimi namjua ni usafi sana. Hata ndio sababu hata mimi nimetoka Uganda nikafika hapa. Kwa hivyo mimi sitaki niseme mengi ila tu kusema sisi zote tumeubwa na Mwenyezi Mungu na Mwenyezi Mungu anataka tukae tunapendana. Na niseme kwangu mimi kuna kitu nimeahidi Mwenyezi Mungu. Kama uongozi wangu utafikia kikomo wakati huu, washa ufike lakini mimi sitaongoza wale watu unaongoza kuwatoa kwa serikali. Mimi tunakaa hapo. Mheshimiwa hapa watu wazitoka. Ile tuliambia watu tushague UDA tunakaa hapo tunasaidiana na rais tunasuwalisaidia na wajube tunaletea wananchi ma, maendeleo kule mashinani na ingawa sisi hatugeomba kuenda vile kumeenda lakini juu kumeenda najua mimi mheshimiwa kidiki ni rafiki yangu zaidi ya miaka kumi. personal friend na juu nyinyi wa Meru kwanza unakumbuka wakati mzee Kibaki alikuwa karibu atolewe kula za tharakanizi ndizo ziliokea mzee Kibaki kwa hivyo mimi naambia watu yetu ya Udhaya, watu yetu ya Nyeri, maana sasa kiumana na sio mapenzi yetu. Sasa <laughs> Aki atige penda kiumane. Lakini sasa si mambo imetukuta tu. Huyu kijana ya Tharakanidi, ile deni walitupatia kuuga mzee Kibaki mkono. Hawa kina mheshimiwa Kiraito wameishi miaka yote sasa kuunga mheshimiwa Kibaki mkono. Safari hii kazi tuseme tu kidiki tosha na vile mheshimiwa sudi amesema hatusemi mheshimiwa kidiki ni kingpin ya Kenya hapa Mount Kenya hapana akue kingpin ya nchi ya Kenya kusaidia mheshimiwa rais William Ruto kuletee wananchi maendeleo sasa si mmesema vile nimesema mimi nimesema mtu afutwe Unajua nitatoka hapa tena unavika huko nyumbani na wewe uliende meru kusema mtu ya nyumbani afupe ah ah nimesema juu kwa bahati mbaya sasa inakaa kama kitaumana kabisa ikiumana sisi nikukaa kwa rais nikukaa kwa naibu yake mheshimiwa kidikidule kidiki na hichi isoge bere na mwenyezi Mungu awabariki asante sana mheshimiwa sudi Sio yako mama ameona live Hama leto makwa jitakuwa George Jenga na demo rutu wa biashara huko kanjo na 
ithue umuthe ni tukorirwo ni kanjo na makuwa indo sito iya twendagia atukuwira nguo moka mpesa ini ma, ma, makuwa ginya mbesa ginya machine iya turuta na cio wira mpesa ini mathi hadi we ini makuwa mahuiru baro na tuthite hathara nene muno wana ithue ni tukaretie gweta andu akanjo twaranirie na tuiguithanie mbesa iria si si kiretwa twagirirwo ni kuriha itagireire taimo ni cia kuoerwa takataka ile ile tutoyagirwo guko na ile ingi ni cia thibitari na ile ito guko tutahetwa service ya thibitari na guko gutukairwa ati twena mata twena street light na totire ile ile tukoria kanjo yoke tuikare the nao tuiguithanirie mbesa ile si tuiganeire tungihota kuriha nigetha turehage mbesa tutare na mathina tondu riu mbesa ile maratwetie na ile matondekeire ni mbesa tutahota gwikinyeria na rekyo tutarihite ona tukiendaga tutingiona kwaguo riu ni turahoya kanjo bado ithi na bena gututhikireria na etie gutuhurira mawira na etie gutukuira indo riu ni tungihoya ona indo ile makuire umuthe matucokerie tondu biashara situ riu ni kugwija maragwithia na uria maisha marituhete tha ici riu makuwete indo cia wira nda gukiuga uhinge wira na ona riu ona magwetagia mbesa icio cia cia kuriha kanjo ili atutari Ndio toke kwa ya kanjo yoke tuikare the nao tuiguithanie mbesa tondu muthi tutinaruta wira twatira tukireithania na kanjo tugetengerania na ithuwe maga tuigua maga gutuigua ithuwe ni tukuhura kuhurana na biashara sito na ni tukugitira biashara sito tondu gutire handu hangi ithuwe twana kindu gya kure uguo ithuwe ni turero turero ana andu a biashara na andu a kanjo moka gutwitia magoti tukigitira mawira maito ginya tugai megaigua makaya maitu matuthikiririe tuikare the tuiguithanirie mbesa iria tungiona tungihota kuriha kanjo ithe tungihoya matie gutuharas matuite mete atongoria andu a biashara guke kanjo tuikare the nao mambe marugamie ku harassment ginya tuiguithanirie tuikare the na twaranirie na tuiguithanirie mbesa iria ithe tungihota kuriha kanjo tuiguithanirie mundu wothe nigetha hote kuriha
na tumesema haki yetu yetu lakini sasa kuvinuliwa haki yetu tuambia kingine haki yetu mmoja tu ahoro ni kajo na Kenya police na twena ruwa muinge ora meka umothe most of the kanjos mauma na uniform age matuma na uniform age mauma Kenya police ma matu akaduka ine moya indo sito age ito twahorwo kiri abere eno ti abere na ti akere na ti agatatu mokaga harassment omothenya omothenya hadhara ni mege muno todo kuna modo ena aduka maita mesere maita mutu makuwaido maita na ne makuwaido eyo ni hadhara nyinge muno magoka makoya ya guo na dami eyo ni hadhara makoya ya bagi si ado magadhi eyo ni hadhara magoka mpesa makoya ginya safi sia modo makahigora makoya besa na makoya machine eyo ni hadhara mwingi muno kajo moke tu maikare ithe na adu akigajo forum matwere ura marenda tondu wa meka umuthi tiwega amare toje ta wojen farugoro wa mwai na no jangire horo wa kigajo horo wa adu akunyarirwo wa kajo Mudanya wa mudhe ni mekire uru muno guka kunyalira andu afia sara ya guku kigajo hindi andu marethera kitu kia kurea maga guka kuhinyere liyandu magetagia marua maga kuwa gira ito andu ito siyao na ne uru muno to mahida maa tole ya hinyere lekuna tole ya kitu kia kurea hindi andu marua leta mesiria maga kwa foro liyo wito radhi ya tea maga soka maga kwa uruwa wera wano wako kuhinyere liyandu hadu hamete andu maikare na othe maga kwa mage sira ya hamwe nao Maika kiri amara na tau mego kuwa gina modo ena marua na modo tale gina na marua na mati kuwa ragi na mau kama kuwa ido ne oru mono tado ida ina re ne ida re tu na madena maike mono magu siriora tu kwa tago soka na ria forori wito na tu na madena maike mono maga suka ne dia gotonya ira modo sio na tau kuwa oru mono ma fatali tago ikara adena do ma menya ora tu go sira na ora tu kwa tago diena bere na tu kwa kuhi nyaga re ria do na kuwa ra re ado ido na ida ne kuwa tora taka do oge ya kuri ya tu. Na ado matire na besa, forori ito ena dena mwige muna totire na bia, hau to kinyete. Nyo na ojugire, maikare dena ado, mahote gosira hamwe na ado. Oka one marwa makiuge de kwero hiyo me, kwero hiyo marwa. Na mea haya do time, ya wetha bia, nika tatu kero hiyo marwa. Hello, my name is Mwihaki Njogu, the chairperson of Ubunifu Eco Train Movement. Ubunifu Eco Train Movement is made up of 16 organizations in the climate justice space. What we do is mobilize youth, uh, depending on their talents, skills and abilities, to be climate action champions. We normally do marches, we do community uh, mobilization and empowerment. We also do tree planting and growing, not just planting trees, but also growing trees. Today we are here for a football tournament where we are using this opportunity to bring young people together and speak more about climate action because usually it's thought about as a very big topic but it narrows down to what you are doing the small things you are doing in your community and what I love saying is that as an individual as a person we all have a social responsibility of conserving our environment and teaching the younger generation of doing the same the challenge we have been facing with communities is that right now everybody their minds are fixed on making money it's so hard to explain to someone why they need a better environment in the next 10 years so the challenge we have been experiencing is growing trees whereby us ourselves after planting trees we have to go back to those communities check up on them weed them out so the communities haven't yet picked up how we would love them to pick up and they become and they make their own green spaces because that is our vision as an eco train movement but we believe we'll get there I believe uh, using football to push the climate justice agenda is effective because when you see in football matches it is mostly young people, youth, and these are the people with the strength, yeah, the manpower of the nation. 
so I believe having something that can entertain them so it's not like they're just sitting down to be taught about climate justice but using football as an avenue of them having fun and also learning more so it is very effective we believe in making an impact in one place and distributing the impact in a ripple effect for now we are organizations within Nairobi but some organizations within the movement uh, have operations even outside the country outside the county but we believe that with time as we continue to empower more young people will have agents of transformation in different areas of the country. Um, the best thing about being in a movement is that it's not about the impact of I as small child organization but the moment I bring Tuvuli in, I, I bring uh, young mothers in, I bring um, Temple Arts, you know, we do more movement, we do more action and the effect we have on the ground is that we are able to cover a larger ground compared to just me doing as my own organization. So collaboration has been the best way for us to go and this is an aspect of us collaborating and putting our minds together. It is our core mandate because even for us we take CSR as a core mandate in our organization because for example our organization like mine, Small Child Organization is about children rights and welfare but when we all come together the environment is something that cannot be neglected. So it is our core mandate as Ubunifu Eco Train movement to ensure that the sustainability and a safe environment for our children as they grow up. I would like the people of Kenya to know that it is in your responsibility to grow trees, not just to plant. It is in your responsibility to look at climate smart agriculture because there's a lot of damage that is being done to our environment based on not farming in a smart way. And I also want to encourage young people, if you have a passion for environment, you can reach out and check us out on social media to Bunifo Eco Train Movement and then you can become part of this train. That's why we are called a train. We pick people from different places. Where are you based? We are based in Nairobi. We are based in Nairobi, but we have operations outside the county. My name is Alan Karioki Mwangi. I am the chairperson of Small Axe Environmental Youth Group that uh, measures in environmental conservation of the riparian of Gadaraine River, right where we are right now. Uh, we have been doing this uh, since 2010, inspired by the late John Michuki. Alipoanza mambo ya Michuki Park na rehabilitation of Nairobi River and uh, so far we have managed to turn a former dam site into a recreation area. Yes, we have done this through partnerships of uh, NGOs, government agencies, individuals and institutions that uh, align with the climate action. Uh, we are also part of a movement called Eco Train Movement. Uh, and a Ubunifu hub, and uh, we are a consortium that uh, aims to change the damage. And uh, today we are here planting some trees uh, as part of the Eco Train tournament. We have a, we have a five-a-side football tournament that is going on right now, and uh, we are here planting trees just to align with the climate action theme as Eco Train movement. Uh, previously, when we started. Uh, we were just volunteers, but uh, over time, uh, climate action has become a cross-cutting issue, and lately, uh, a lot of funds have been invested uh, in mitigating and, uh, and adaptation on climate change, and as a result, we are now hopeful. It is not yet a reality, but we are hopeful that uh, it will come to give us green jobs. Uh, most recently, the president launched the Climate Works. As former Kazim Taani and some of our members were enrolled last week. They have already started the works, so it is like uh, guys are being paid to do whatever they were doing voluntarily. Uh, for sustainability, uh, that is another issue because uh, it needs to be sustainable so that uh, youth will get sustainable jobs. Siatileo and Endas Kukumi, because we understand Endas Kukumi, Munatulia, and then Wengino and Engias Kukumi. So they need to make it sustainable so that kwanza kabisa to sufficient mazingira na katika harakati ya to mazingira watu wapate kitu ya kukula. When the late John Michuki was uh, started the radical process of cleaning Nairobi River, uh, we are lucky we had a river passing through our location. And uh, 
inspired by John Michuki, the river, our river was very polluted. Sababu ndiyo garbage collectors walikuwa na letatakataka, waiting for the then municipal council wakuja wachukue. But then unapata scavengers, like uh, human, birds, animals, hiyo takataka ikajia kwa mto. It was very bad. So tulikuja tukanza ku clean clean, inspired by Michuki. Of course we had many challenges, lakini along the way we overcame them. Uh, another thing that it to inspire as we did the process, nikwamba most of us have grown the area. Mini lijua kuswim kwa irive, puko downstream. So seeing it very contaminated na dirty, the water is actually black, sailia kunyeshi. So when you tulianza, we got more inspiration poor. This is the river we used to swim na saini chafu. We need to make it better, at least at Akama Sikuetu for the future generations. Yes. I uh, would like to encourage each and everyone to take care of the environment. Because uh, if not for another thing, for our safety. Kama last time when you flood, tumewana vile mafuriko, imechukua watu wengi na ika affect lives mingi. And it is because of the little actions, little vices that we do each and every day. So neza taka hiyo, tuanze kuku live sustainably, tuanze ku reduce takataka enye tunatumia. And uh, I would encourage each and every one of us, kwanza takataka ndi naharibu mazingira. So we should uh, sort our, our waste from the house. Tusichanganya takataka wet na takataka nyesi wet. So that tata zikienda mali zina recycle it will be very easy. Another thing.